Hi everyone, welcome back to another daily energy draw. This is going to be for when? Tuesday, October 29th, 2019. Today we're going to be using the Work Your Light deck. Let me know how you guys did for the new moon. How you guys are feeling. We're still in that energy a few days after the new moon, so let me know how you guys are doing. This is for Tuesday, October 29th, 2019. Spirit, what do you have to say for Tuesday, October 29th, 2019? Just a reminder, if you guys missed my live stream yesterday, you can order my new message decks, my Oracle decks. Oh, I'm not going to get them out just yet. Um, well, they're in the bags here. <laughs> My two message decks, I actually have three. Um, you can order them at the link below. So feel free to go ahead and check them out. And I will also be having um, a walkthrough going up on the channel today. So make sure that you stay tuned for that if you want to see all the messages that are in all of the decks. All right, Tuesday, October 29th, 2019. You wanted to come out. Trust your path. Beautiful. If you knew you would be supported, what would you do? This has been coming up when we were doing the daily energy draws before. It was a big message of trusting yourself and trusting your path. This journey is not for the faint of heart. We say that all the time. This is a very tumultuous back and forth roller coaster. And you are on this journey because you were meant to be on this journey. Because your soul wanted it. Because you and your partner wanted it. You and your counterpart. But, but your own soul growth and your own evolution, this is for you. This is because you wanted to grow. You wanted to ascend. You wanted to remember and awaken to who you truly are, which is that love and that light. You wanted to remember your divinity. You wanted to remember how powerful and beautiful and strong you are, that you are the soul, that you are that love, that you are that light, that you are Christ consciousness itself, that you are the universe itself, co-creating with the universe because you are the universe. You wanted to remember this. So this journey has been about trusting yourself. It's been about not focusing so much on the external 3D world because that is the illusion and going within and really trusting your heart. From the very beginning, we've been channeling as within, so without. It really does come with, from within you. What is it that you want to manifest? What is it that you want to create? What vision do you hold for your future? What is it that you dream of? Because nothing is impossible if you trust yourself and if you trust that you are on the right path and that you will always be supported, that the universe does have your back because the universe is you. That's part of co-creation. You are working together. My friend actually recent me, uh, recently sent me a post from Elizabeth Gilbert. I think it was from 2018 where she talked about, I think it was her nephew or godson or something like that, who had channeled a message saying, you are safe. And that really hit home for me because how many of us don't feel safe in this world? How many of us don't feel safe to be our true authentic selves? How many of us don't feel safe to express our emotions or express our truth or to say what we really feel, to say what we really mean, to go after what we want, to go after our dreams? How many of us just don't feel safe? But that not feeling safe is coming from a lack of trust. You have to trust in yourself and you have to trust in the divine and understand that you are co-creating together, that you are safe because you are divinely protected, because you are divine yourself. I'm hearing from spirit. Do you see how that works? Do you see how that works? Do you get it now? <laughs> you are divine yourself. You are protected because you are one with the universe. You are, they're telling me, I don't remember who said it, but you are made of stardust. That saying, you're made of stardust, just goes to show that you are part of the universe. And because you're part of the universe, all you have to do is trust that you will always be protected. It's just the ego that likes to live in that fear of not knowing and not having that control and not feeling certain about what the next step in your life is going to be. But that's part of the adventure they're saying. That's part of the magic. That's part of why you came here too, to experience that. But the beauty is to trust and allow things to unfold because as you come from a place of trust and allowing things to unfold, that's where the magic happens. That's where the faith is necessary because that's where the magic happens. Knowing that you and the universe are creating in this world together, experiencing in this world together. So what would you do if you knew that you were safe, if you had trust in yourself and in the universe? What would you do? 
Ask yourself that honest question. Go deep within and say, what would I do if I knew that I was truly safe? If I knew that I couldn't fuck anything up? If I knew that I could have faith and that things would unfold so beautifully and so magically, exactly as I wanted to experience it, what would you do? And I'm hearing from spirit, go out and do it. Go out and take that first step. Go out and take that leap of faith because you are protected. You are safe. All right, you guys. That's going to be it for today's Daily Energy Draw. I am sending you so much love, so much light. We'll see you tomorrow.